folks, it's Bunny Love. Kid Rock directs sexual slurs to Oprah Winfrey and claims he's not a racist and he's walked off the stage. Let's talk about it. Kid Rock may not just have a thinking problem based on footage obtained by TMZ of a sexually explicit tirade the singer went into against several female talk show hosts on stage at his Nashville bar this week in a state the website described as clearly intoxicated. The video posted by TMZ ends with Kid Rock being helped off the lip of the stage in an awkward manner by handlers. I'm like Oprah Winfrey or Joy Bihar. They can suck dick sideways. The star said in the video repeatedly mentioning as if he were pushing someone's head toward his crouch. Ooh, oh my. He even had visual aids going on, huh? That's something. Fuck Oprah Winfrey and fuck Kathy Lee Gifford, he said. As someone near the smartphone filming, his monologue is heard to exclaim, he's blackout drunk. Gifford was recently in the news in Nashville for moving to town, but unlike Winfrey and Bihar, the volatile rapper was not known to have any previously issues against her before. Rock is seen later repeating the suck dick sideways phrase against specifically in connection with Winfrey and then immediately leaps to preeminently declare that he knows he will be accused of being a racist for his comments. To those who would say, well, I'm pretty sure Kid Rock's a racist, he said, I'm like, fine, fuck off sideways. I'm not the bad guy in this equation, the 48-year-old star declares. I'm the fucking guy you want. Like, hey, he's pretty cool. The episode occurred just days shy of the one year anniversary of Rock doing a live morning remote with Fox and Friends in which he said, screw that Joy Behar bitch, with host Steve Doisy trying to cut him off. That November 30th, 2018 episode led him to being fired that same day from his role as Grand Marshal of the Nashville Christmas Parade. Rock returned to the news in August when he tweeted that Taylor Swift wants to be a Democrat because she wants to be in movies. And it looks like she will suck the doorknob off Hollyweird to get there. Oldest move in the book. Good luck, girl. The incident occurred at Kid Rock's big ass honky tonk rock and roll steakhouse which was the subject of controversy in Nashville in January when a 20-foot neon sign was installed that included a facsimile of woman's buttocks. Nashville City Council ultimately voted to allow the racy sign with strong dissent from some members who felt it would leave tourists with a vulgar image of the city. The rapper has had calmer moments in the news this year, like when he went golfing with President Trump in March. Subsequently, describing the president, for whom he has frequently expressed support, as down-to-earth and cool. Well, you guys, here's my commentary on the matter. I do not believe that Oprah Winfrey is even going to bother to respond. She's much bigger than that. She's way bigger than him, entertainment-wise and financially. So I'm sure she's probably looking at the situation like, you're a small piece of shit to me. I don't have to answer you. And, you know, I don't think he was being racist with his statements. I mean, he made statements about two other white women as well. M maybe a little sexist, but not racist. So I don't know if racist would fit this situation because he made comments about Oprah, but he also made comments about Joy Bahar and Kathy Lee Gifford as well. So this was more of a, if you want to call him anything, call him a sexist not a racist. Maybe he is racist. Who knows? But he didn't just attack a black woman. He also attacked two other women that were white as well. So that doesn't make any sense to just call him a racist. How about call him a sexist? Like I said, I do not believe that Oprah Winfrey's even going to respond to this fuckery. She, I'm sure she probably feels like she's much bigger and better than that. And 
probably is like, this is just not worth it. It's not worth my time or my energy because I'm sure somebody in the media is going to reach out to her. And what do you think about the things that Kid Rock had to say about you? Oh, so Kid Rock, you know, told me to suck, uh, suck his dick and moving on. I'm Oprah Winfrey. People have said more and even worse about me. Who gives a fuck? I'm, I'm sure that's going to be her attitude. She doesn't care. She doesn't care. So you guys, that's all I pretty much wanted to say about this video. Kid Rock was at his Nashville bar acting a fool, drunk and saying crazy stuff about some of the women in the industry. The media finds out about it. Here I'm talking about it because of the blogs. I found this information in the blogs and I figured you guys would find this story interesting as well. Drop your comments below. Let me know what you think. Do you think that Oprah Winfrey, Kathy Lee Gifford, or Miss Joy Bahar should even bother to respond to this? I don't. I think it's stupid. I think it's silly. And he was just a drunk bastard that didn't realize what the hell he was saying out of his mouth. You guys, that's my time. I'm out of here. I'm going to go ahead and go. Follow me on all social media platforms. The ending of this video will have just where you can find me on the net. Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube here, of course, subscribe and check me out for more celebrity gossip talk, current news and reality show reviews. Peace and blessings, folks. Take care and have a wonderful, beautiful day. Enjoy. Don't forget to add the underscore when adding me on Instagram.